The Ford Edge and its Lincoln Nautilus luxury counterpart will be retired after the 2023 model year. A third-generation Edge doesn't appear to be planned, though Ford has no intention of abandoning the mid-size crossover segment entirely. Instead, it's widely expected to offer an all-electric alternative, something that'll fit very nicely into the Blue Oval's planned EV lineup expansion that currently includes the Mustang Mach-E and F-150 Lightning. An all-electric Explorer is also on the way. One thing is for certain, this new EV crossover won't be called the Edge. Something new is required and today we might have stumbled upon our first clue, Ford has trademarked the name Evos with Mexico's trademark office, the Instituto Mexicano de la Propiedad Industrial. We're already familiar with this name. Last April, the Ford Evos crossover or SUV or wagon debuted at the Shanghai Motor Show and it looks fantastic especially its 3D parametric style front grille connecting the LED headlights, pop-out door handles, and the interior's massive 3.6-foot long widescreen display. Ford's North American Product Communications Chief, Mike Levin, quickly responded to questions about the Evo's potential U.S. market arrival. He confirmed the Evo's is for customers in China only. But now it appears it could be for customers in Mexico too. If so, that potentially opens the door for a US market entry. Carbuzz.com reached out to Levine regarding this latest news, and he responded that, trademark applications are intended to protect new phrases, designs or symbols but aren't necessarily an indication of new business or product plans. Not a confirmation but not a complete denial either. Ford could possibly build the Evos at its Hermosillo, Mexico assembly plant, which is also the home of the Bronco Sport, Escape, and the new Maverick. We've reached out to Levine again and will provide his response hopefully soon. If the Evos was America-bound, we doubt it'll come in its current form. Again, whatever replaces the Edge will be a pure battery electric and, at the moment, there isn't an off-road wagon like EV on the market, save for the far more expensive Porsche taken cross Turismo. The affordable outdoor adventure wagon segment is currently owned by the Subaru Outback. Last time we checked, Subaru isn't exactly an EV leader. There's a golden opportunity for Ford here and the Evos could be that vehicle.